Hey everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. So today I have a general message for you guys. This is going to be a random collective message that somebody out there needs to hear. Whoever needs to hear this will come across this reading. So this may not resonate for everyone, okay? So let's get straight into this and find out what Spirit wants you to know. Okay, so I can see that there's a lot of confusion surrounding a connection, okay? Um, you feel a lot of love here for this person. You feel such a strong connection to this person. Like, you have literally never felt this way before um, about anybody. But the thing is that whatever is happening in the 3D is causing a lot of confusion here, okay? I am seeing that you're dealing with somebody that's making no movement towards you, okay? Um, they could have... A different option they could be pretending that they're happy with somebody else okay um, but they feel the connection as well you could be dealing with a cancer you could be dealing with an Aquarius it's like this person pretending they don't feel this way they it's like they've met you okay they could have been already in something else with somebody else um, and now it's like they're still pretending that they're happy in that situation. They pre they're pretending they don't feel the way they do about you, right? So it's causing a lot of confusion. This person's very detached from their heart at the moment. This person's really guarded, okay, because I'm getting that they, it's like they're pretending that they're happy, okay, but they're not happy in a situation that once made them happy. They actually feel completely stuck, but this person likes to have everything under control, so it's like they're acting like everything's okay in their life. Um, when you look at this person, you feel like this person is happy. This person's a really good actor as well, like, they're really good at, um... I'm hearing masking pain, okay? It's like this person... I'm getting that you're dealing with somebody that's stuck in something, okay? They could be married or in a commitment already, okay? They feel completely stuck here, okay? They feel like they don't know how to move away from this, okay? They feel like their heart is with you, like they can't get over you and they know that they're meant to be with you, but they don't know how to move forward. This person's not good with change. Like, they don't really know how to handle change. Um, it's like they're just pretending everything's okay. It's like they're ignoring this love as well. Um, they know about the connection, okay? This person holds themselves on a really... It's like you look at them and they're fine, right? Like, because they hold themselves really well, okay? Um, we have the Emperor and the Empress coming out together, okay? So, it's like you both know... You're meant to be together, but I am getting for this, um, for this connection, I'm getting the feminine here is actually stuck in something or pretending that they're happy where they're at, okay? Pretending that they're happy where they're at, yet it's like they want to be with this masculine here. There's a lot of confusion, okay, on both sides okay you guys are both mirroring each other you guys both feel like you're meant to be together you could be dealing with a taurus aries or libra i am seeing this masculine um okay so i'm seeing this dynamic where this masculine is trying to come at the feminine here but the feminine like the feminine done with this like they're like you know this is over um you may be looking at other options this masculine may have hurt you a lot to the point where you're like over this connection so 
So you have um, this masculine overthinking this situation, really wanting to be with you, okay? The thing is, is they're really closed-minded as well. This masculine is determined, okay, to start a new beginning here with you, okay? They feel like they're meant to be with you, but they're really confused because I'm getting that you've closed your energy off to this person, which is really making this person think. Um, I am seeing that this person really hurt you in the past, okay? They caused some type of disaster in this connection, right? They could have been sneaky, manipulative, okay? I am getting this masculine... You guys are both mirroring the fact that you pretend that you're fine when you're not, right? You both have a very, like, tough exterior where you just act like you guys are both fine, but you both are longing to be with each other. You both are missing each other. This Divine Masculine especially is missing you, but they're pretending that they're fine. They're overthinking this as well. Like, they're really in their mind about the connection. I'm hearing the name Nicholas. So there's a lack of communication. Somebody's not making a choice to leave some type of karmic situation. Um, there's an ending that needs to happen here, but so this loving beginning can start, which you both want to happen, but somebody here is not making a move towards this, right? Um, I'm getting both of you have lost hope. You're both pretending that you're fine, okay, but you're both not fine. You both want to be together. See, this divine masculine, okay, they're thinking, thinking, thinking about you. They're trying to think about how they can come forward. Um, you're more in your heart center, but I do see you looking away from this divine masculine because you feel like this divine masculine played too many games. They also put you in a um, state of, yeah, they could be in a third party situation. They put you in a state of um, confusion. Wow. You both want to be together. You both want to be together, but nobody's communicating this. Like there's no action in 3D. There could be a third party in the way. Somebody's not moving away from something. Like, it's time to leave um, a third-party situation, but somebody's not making the move. They may be trying to work things out with this third party, yet wanting to be with um, the divine counterpart, right? Especially if you're dealing with a masculine here, okay? They may be pretending that they're fine. Um, again, you guys mirror this, where you both pretend that you're fine, but you both want to be together. You both want this commitment. But you feel like this Divine Masculine has done you wrong. I'm getting this Divine Masculine because it brought, brought a third party into this. Um, they could be playing happy families with this third party um, and ignoring this connection. But they're getting so many signs about the connection. They feel stupid as well because it's like they know that they want to be with you. They know they're meant to be with you. They see this connection, but yet they don't really know how to make the move towards you. Lack of communication, guys. This divine masculine is looking at you in, um, like, a whole different... They're looking at you in a whole different way because I'm getting that, for some of you, the, this feminine here um, is keeping themselves stuck or just acting like they don't want this connection, walking away from this connection. For some of you, the feminine here is stuck in this third-party situation, right? And for some of you, they feel like that they've done something here that they cannot come back from, that you've literally cut your energy, like, away from. You don't want anything to do with them. Could be, like, some type of scandal. Okay. I'm hearing the name Elizabeth. Yeah, this person definitely was not thinking, okay? Um, this person stuck on you. You guys mirror each other a lot. This person stuck on you, but they came at you in the wrong way. Um, they weren't really thinking. This person feels like they can't just pick up the phone and call you for some reason. Yeah, they feel like they've done something that 
they're not sure if you're going to accept their apology. They do want to apologize, though, and they want to fix communication here. They may have been looking at other options. If masculine may have been looking at other options. Um, you both are mirroring the fact that you cannot get over each other. Yeah, this divine masculine could have gone in a different direction towards somebody else, um, brought somebody else into the picture, and now they feel like that you would never take them back. They're also not happy where they're at, like they want to be with you. I'm getting that the divine feminine here is literally manifesting new beginnings, um, new opportunities are coming into their life, okay, um, yeah, this person, this masculine is stuck on you, in the past they felt like they had options, okay, and they chose the wrong one, now they're stuck on you, but now it's like you have options, and they're stuck on you, it's like you guys have switched energy, No matter what this person does, like, they cannot forget about you. They're stuck on you here. But they feel like, wow, this person really wants to come forward and tell you the truth. They want to come forward and let you know how they're truly feeling. They want this new beginning here. They feel so much passion and love here for you. But... This, this divine masculine, okay, they do not feel good enough for you, okay, they do not feel good enough for you, they feel like they need to work on themselves, especially their finances, um, yeah, so they can take action towards this, because at the moment, they're looking at you and they feel like that you're in this energy where you have all these opportunities, you have all this, um, like, a lot of people want to be with you. They feel like they're a step behind you, right? And they feel like that you would judge them at the moment. Like, if they came forward, they feel like that you would judge them because you are in a better position than them. Okay, this is just their fear, though. You could be dealing with an Aquarius. You could be dealing with a Sagittarius. So you've got this masculine, okay, so in love with you, okay, knowing that they want to be with you, stuck on you, right, but holding themselves back from communicating with you because they feel like that they've, like this is a missed opportunity, that they've made their bed here. They walked away in the past, okay, um, caused a lot of imbalance here, maybe made, the, maybe made the wrong choice or lied. I'm getting this person wasn't really honest with their um, feelings either. You could be dealing with the Capricorn here. This person feels like you have so many opportunities and they've ruined their chance. And they're really confused, okay? Because I'm getting that you've pulled your energy back, okay? And you're focused on other things at the moment. You're not focused on them at the moment. Um, and this is making them really confused, okay? There's a lot of confusion. They don't really know if you want this or not. Um... But they did bring some type of third party into the situation. They tried to manipulate you, okay? Even though they have known from the get-go they're in love with you, they haven't been very expressive about that. They've actually been trying to play games, right? They've definitely caused some type of barrier between you two. And they know they've made the wrong choice. This person can't stop watching you, okay? They can't stop thinking about you. They can't stop watching you, okay? Um, no matter what they do, it's like they cannot run from this situation. They cannot... They literally cannot... Like, they try to run, but then they get all this um, signs about you, okay? They can't forget about you. It's like they continuously reminded that they made the wrong choice. You could be dealing with a Leo. This person's not happy without you. They feel like that there's something about your energy that just makes them so happy. I'm hearing the name Jesse, okay, so this could be Jessica as well, but when I heard that, I heard that song Jesse Girl, okay, so this person may um, feel like you're moving on or something, they definitely feel like uh, you're the empress, okay, and they feel like you've, they've done, 
they've done you wrong, okay? They don't feel good enough for you at the moment. They feel like they didn't realise your worth and they did something sneaky here to cause a separation. They may have chosen somebody else over you. Yeah, this person feels like that they've ended this, but they can't get over it. Like, they want a new beginning here. They're not... It's like they can't feel... Yeah, they're stressed out. They do not feel content at the moment, okay? Because all they want to do is reach out to you. They're in a really bad place. Um, ever since this has ended, um, and they're not in their li in your life anymore, they're in a really dark place. All they want to do is fix this with you and reconcile, okay? But I am getting this person manipulated you. I'm hearing the name Monique. Um, this person manipulated you, right? They literally may have done something intentionally to hurt you, right? Like, they may have tried to make you compete or tried to talk to somebody. I'm getting they tried to, like, talk to somebody um, in front of you or try to glamorize somebody else and try to make you jealous, but you cut them off. Like, you literally blocked them, you cut them off. And now they want to talk to you, they're stressed out because they don't know how to fix this. They wish they never played these games. Yeah, this person, okay, you're dealing with somebody that's very selfish, very stubborn, okay? They were holding back their feelings, trying to play games, trying to get a reaction out of you. It's like they felt this connection, but they weren't really sure how you felt, so they tried to play some type of game to see how you were truly feeling, okay? Instead of trying to communicate with you, they were trying to play some games, trying to make you jealous, and you ended up just cutting them off. When you cut this person off, though... Guide, when you cut this person off, I'm telling you, they realise that they were... They realise that they're in love with you, okay? Like, it took you cutting them off, blocking them, um, calling them out on their bullshit for them to realise, like, holy shit, like, this is the one, right? This person admires your strength, okay? There's something very strong about you, about your presence, about your personality that they, they admire, like, they've never met anybody like you. Wow, this person tried. They have tried to find you in other people. Holy shit, no. I'm getting, for some of you, two other people, okay? They tried to find you in two other people, and it didn't work. Now they're realizing that, no, you have their heart, okay? Like, you're the only one, right? Like, there is no one like you. You could be dealing with an Aquarius. You could be dealing with a Taurus. I said two other people, but could be three other people for some of you, okay? For some two, for some one, for some three, okay? Some of these people have been looking for you in other people, and now they realize that they cannot find that. And now they feel like that they've, they've fucked shit up. They do not know how to come back from this. They've lost hope, okay? It's like they've lost hope in their everyday life. They don't even know what to do with themselves okay i'm getting this person could be really depressed at the moment continuously thinking about you and wanting to communicate with you this person's in a lot of darkness at the moment they feel like you would never take them back they are so immature they showed you a complete... They showed you somebody that why would you want to take them back? They play too many games. They're not honest about their feelings, okay? They feel like that you have plenty of options. Um, and they come off as somebody that... I'm, I'm hearing bipolar. They could be bipolar, okay? It's like this person's stuck on you. But they're having a hard time leaving something else. This person feels defeated, okay? It's like they're not moving. Nothing's moving in their life, okay? It's like they're just sitting there. Like, I'm literally just picturing somebody sitting there, and they're not sure what to do. They feel like they've literally manipulated their whole life because they walked away from this connection. You could be dealing with a Sagittarius or a Cancer. Um, either way, this person showed you somebody 
that is not to be trusted, okay, somebody that's, like, sort of evil as well, um, and now it's like they're stuck on you, okay, they definitely tried to find you and other people, and that just did not work out, um, they're realising now that there is no one like you, um, and they want a new connection, like, a new beginning here with you, again, there's a lot of mirroring here in this connection, I just seen 2020, um, there's a lot of mirroring here, um, so you guys are literally mirroring each other. This person wants a new beginning here with you, but they feel like there is no coming back from how they've treated you, right? So that's all I have for you. I really hope this resonated. If it did, please let me know in the comments. Please don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.